makes a really great relationship in the beginning, when you're first meeting somebody, is when you want somebody in your life, but you're not at that desperate time where you need to have somebody in your life. There's a big difference between needing somebody and wanting somebody. When you want somebody in your life, it's because you've got you got all your ducks in a row. Things are going really well for you and you're ready. You can have you have room to allow somebody to come into your world. When you need somebody, there's something a lot of the times that's missing. You're not content with what's going on in your life. There's there's a piece of the puzzle that just isn't fitting and that's driving you crazy. But a lot of times when you need somebody in your life, you make them your whole life. And that's a big problem with a lot of people. They rely on their partners to make them feel whole. And while it's true that, you know, when you're in a really great relationship, you are an extension of each other because you give each other things that maybe you don't already have, or at least you come together with things and you can work together. But the big problem here is that people get to the stage where they get sort of depressed because they feel like they're never going to meet anybody. So it becomes sort of a desperate attempt at trying to meet somebody. They get frustrated, they get mad, and they get really hurt. They turn into a cocoon in their house, or they go on a rampage where they date like every two, every two days they've got a new date and they're out there. When you are happy with yourself and what's going on in your life. So obviously we're not always going to be perfectly happy. We have things we need to work on on a continual basis. But if the majority of your life is going well, you've got some great things happening that you enjoy doing, you've got passion in your life in a sense of uh, projects or, or career, you've got great friends, you've got things that you love to do that are hobbies, that makes your life so great. And there's room because you're happy to bring somebody to come in because you're sort of pretty much complete about who you are. And this is really important when you want to date somebody. A lot of times people will sit there and complain that they don't meet somebody or dating sucks, all these problems with dating today. But if you have your stuff going on, it's a lot easier to meet somebody because most of the time you're happy. You're actually welcoming when you meet somebody. You're not jaded, you're not guarded because so much great things are happening for you already. And then you meet somebody or you talk to somebody, you come across gre gregarious and happy and fun to be around. But the people that keep dating and don't understand that they need to have their own lives fulfilled, at least most of it, before you meet somebody. And that's the key. That's why when you want somebody in your life, you're ready. You're ready to have them in your life because you're happy with who you are. Needing somebody is completely different. So make sure you're kind of aware of the two because they really are different. So when you're out dating and you're getting frustrated, take a little time away from it for a bit. Sit back and just sort of start looking at your life. What's missing? What's missing besides a partner? Look at that part first. And then when you've got all those things happening, the partner will, will come in eventually because you'll be ready to receive them. Anyway, thanks so much for listening to Dear Cyber C today. Please subscribe to my channel here on YouTube and uh, like the video below. I really appreciate it. Thank you.